Hello, I'm Jason with Jai Tech. We'll be taking an inside look at the Remix OS. One of the features that is most unique to the Remix OS is the taskbar. As an Android-based operating system, we have customized various aspects of the OS to make your tablet a better productivity tool. The flashing portion of the screen is the Remix OS taskbar. Next are five aspects of the taskbar we would like to introduce. 1. Switching between apps. All open apps appear on the taskbar at the bottom of the screen and can be opened or minimized by clicking on the app's respective icon. Click on the icon to open apps. If these apps are opened in phone mode, you can display multiple apps simultaneously. In stock Android, you must use other keystrokes in order to toggle between apps. The taskbar makes switching between multiple apps easy. 2. The back and home buttons. Please direct your attention to the flashing buttons. Remix OS's taskbar has two key buttons on the bottom left of the screen. The left button is the back button. The one on the right is the home button. These two buttons are fairly self-explanatory, so we won't go into further detail here. We've put these two buttons next to one another for both functional ease and to make our taskbar more aesthetically pleasing. 3. The menu button. Please look at the bottom right of the taskbar. This is the one menu tool unique to the Remix OS. This button serves two main functions. When all apps are minimized, pressing the menu button opens a power saving functionality. By clicking Memory Cleanup, the Remix will automatically close all minimized apps. If you select a single app and then tap the menu button, the menu drawer will reflect options for just that application. Aside from indicating which app is currently in use, the menu drawer also allows switching between phone and full screen mode as well as closing the app with Quit App. 4. Pinning apps to the taskbar. For some apps that you use regularly, you can select and drag and pin these apps to the taskbar. If you want to remove a pinned app from your taskbar, you can always drag and drop the app icon off the taskbar. If your app is open and you drag and drop it off the taskbar, you will simply close this app. 5. Hiding your taskbar. If you feel the taskbar is interfering with your on-screen activities, you can always minimize the taskbar. If you hold down the taskbar, a pop-up window will appear allowing you to hide taskbar. If you've already hidden the taskbar, you only need to swipe to the bottom edge of the screen in order to reveal the taskbar. In Settings, under Display, you will also have the choice to automatically hide and show the taskbar. Okay, well this will be our tutorial for today. Stay tuned for our next episode.